Hello everyone, I'm Marzia Merju, I'm Data Analytics Business Analyst at DSI and today I'm going to show you how to create uh, dynamic text in Power BI. I'll start with an um, easy example. Here what we have is uh, sales uh, in different regions and in a higher level we have our uh, territory groups. So originally the title we see is sales by region but when I select Europe or any territory group, the title changes to sales by region in Europe or sales by region in North America. So how do we create this dynamic text here? Uh, we'll do that with a measure. So I created a measure called title and this measure is um, saying if um, has one value territory group so if any specific value is selected in territory group then our title or the value of our measure is sales by region in concatenated with the value of the territory group that value that is uh, selected otherwise if no value is selected then our um, title is simply sales by region now let's see another example here, um, our title is select a product category to see the most expensive product. So on the left side, we have our product categories that is showing the sales for different product categories. And on the right side, we have our products and their uh, price. So when I select a specific product category like bikes, the title changes to among bikes, road bikes are the most expensive products. So we have, we, we know now, now that what is the most expensive product among, road, among bikes and um, what is the maximum price in that uh, product subcategory. Or if I select accessories, it changes to what is the most expensive accessory and what is the maximum price there. So let's go and look at the measure, how we created that. So again, I'm saying if it has one value product category, so if any of these product categories are selected, then the value of my title will be among the value of that product category that is selected. So it comes here with the um, DAX function values and then it's concatenated with comma and then I'll go and find what is the most expensive product in that category. So I'll do that with a lookup value. Uh, it goes and searches among the product subcategories, what is the maximum list price, and then brings that product category. And I'll continue my text with are the most expensive with maximum, and then now I want to find what is the maximum price. So I'll go and look up the product price for the maximum um, price that I have for those product categories. So this will be the value of my measure if a product category is selected. If this has one value is false, then my title will simply be select a product category to see the most expensive product. That was all for today. I hope you enjoyed it and you create this dynamic text in your exciting Power BI reports. Thank you. Bye.